In this parsha, we learn about the blessings that God promises if we do his mitzvot and follow his laws, and about the consequences if we don't follow his laws. The Talmud says that one should always reject with the left arm and embrace with the right arm, meaning that even if a situation arises that we need to discipline a child and it requires some consequences, still says the Talmud at that very same time, you should embrace the child, love the child, and uplift the child. But the Rebbe asks the question, why does the Talmud say reject with your left and embrace with your right? Why not reject with the right and embrace with the left? And the Rebbe gives this beautiful answer. For most people, the right arm is the stronger arm and the left arm is the weaker arm. And this is the message of the Talmud, that when you need to discipline a child or a student and you need to give some consequences, do it with your left arm, with the weaker arm, which means not with your full force and intensity, do it softly. But when you embrace a child, reward a child, and love a child, do it with your right, with your stronger arm, with your full force and full intensity. Have a very good Shabbos.